Mobile Mayor Sandy Stimson continues to distance himself from the Connick Cowboys tonight. Now, the parents of the football player beaten in Davidson's locker room last year are demanding an apology over the content of one of the signs from yesterday's parade. NBC 15's Nicole Fierro joins us now. Nicole, the mayor didn't want any part of this fight. Greg and Andrea, he responded to my request for comment, but I'm sorry wasn't a part of his answer. The Comic Cowboy signed stirring controversy, opening up wounds for an alleged hazing victim. It reads, bad news, Davidson football hazing. Good news, they finally beat someone. It went way, way too far. I mean, that shouldn't have been touched, period. He's a minor, he's a child. Following yesterday's parade, the Kim family sent a letter to the mayor's office, demanding an apology from Mayor Sandy Stimson and the Comic Cowboys. I feel Mayor Sandy Stimson should have um, informed them before Fat Tuesday. N that's a touchy subject, don't go there. He's a child at the end of the day. What would you like to say about Comet Cowboys? Well, I really yesterday? have no comment about the Comet Cowboys. I mean, we've had those conversations in years past. Um, and, you know, there's very little, as a matter of fact, there's nothing that the mayor or the city council can do about that. Mm -hmm. And so we've rehashed that and have rehashed it. So no comments other than what I just told you. Okay? Perfect. I know that the Kim family said that they wanted an apology, I'm but. Not, I'm, not, I'm not going there. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Thank Appreciate you. it. Mayor Stimson left the Comet Cowboys in 2017 after controversial floats that year. I called the Comic Cowboys to see if they have an apology or response to the Kim's request. I've not heard back from the organization at this time. Andrew and